What's going on YouTube? Subum Saint bringing you another review this week. This week we're going to take a look at a juice line called GQV. Great quality vape. Now this was sent to me by Wolfpack Wholesale for the purposes of this review. Uh, also, I will be doing a giveaway announcement on the winners of the giveaway that I posted last week. So definitely stay tuned for all that. Um, first thing first is a few things about this juice. Comes in 30 mil bottles. That's all you get. Roughly $18 for a 30 mil. Uh, bleh, a 30 mil. Comes in 0, 1.5, 3, 6, and a 12 nick. Um, I will be reviewing four flavors from their line here. They do have... Let me hit, see here. Now they do have the KLP. Which I'll go over all these. And as I'm tasting them, all that. Then they have Venice Peach, West Coast Frappe, Kiwi Berry Dreamin', and that'll be about it. So, first things first, let us, let us go over the KLP. So, this KLP is a Cali Popular Key Lime Pie with a soft graham cracker finish, refreshing, cool as the California vibe itself. So, let's go ahead and go on vape some of this okay so i have the e-fusion dna 200 here with the goon rda by 528 customs at 0.32 ohms at 75 watts and let's go ahead and put a little bit of this on the fresh cotton here guys all right Now, I'm not a huge fan of key lime pie. I just, I've never been into it. It's just not my flavor. I just don't like lime flavors. It's kind of weird because I'm, I'm kind of into it. I like Mountain Dew, but like key lime pie is just weird for me. But anyways, now what I get with this flavor is a burst of key lime. So if you're, if you're looking for a spot on key lime pie, this would be it. Um, you get a nice graham cr cracker finish about halfway through the inhale, exhale, all the way through to the exhale. The graham cracker flavoring is just amazing. I love the graham cracker flavoring. It's really, really good. I have no complaints of that at all. Uh, I would have to say this is probably my second favorite one out of their juice line, even though I'm not a key lime pie, uh, uh, key lime pie fan. So, I mean... That speaks volumes. I mean, it's actually really, really good. Now, I can't go over the VEG and PG. Uh, they did not tell me that. I do not have any information. I looked all online for it. So, do not know the VEG and PG ratio of any of this juice. So, I do apologize for that. Um, also, um, definitely, definitely, hold on. You definitely get that key lime, just like right there in the beginning. About halfway through the exhale, you get the graham cracker crust, and it's a really, really good graham cracker crust. Like, I mean, it's probably definitely in the top three of the graham cracker crust that I've tasted, so it's definitely a very good graham cracker crust. Definitely, definitely good. All right. Now, next one is going to be Venice Peach. Now, Venice Peach here is a fresh and fruity strawberry smoothie swirled with juicy peaches and a scoop of ice cream or cream. Smooth and chill like a day at the beach. So, I do have it on the Joy Tech Cuboid 150 watt at 75 watts. 0.37 ohm coils, 5.27 volts, and it's on the phenotype L with the top airflow. And let me go ahead and I gotta make sure it's actually juiced up. I don't, you know, I don't want to dry hit like halfway in the video. I'm sure that would give you guys some laughs, man. But nah, man, nah. But anyways, all right, let's give Venice Peach a try here. This one, you definitely get a fresh peach taste. I mean, it is just, 
It's not like canned peaches or anything like that. It is actually like taking a peach off the tree and eating it. That is how you get... I mean, that's the peach flavor I get with this one. It's just... Don't really get a whole lot of cream. Now, I... It's, it's, it's there. The strawberries and the cream is kind of there. But, I mean, the peach is just overwhelming it so much. So, you get a slight strawberry taste. Roughly, a little bit partially in on the inhale. Mostly get the strawberry and the light cream on the exhale. But, the peach is definitely overwhelming in this one. It's not... It's not a bad overwhelming, but it's overwhelming the strawberries and the cream. But it still is a very good juice, and I definitely say this is my third favorite one in the line. So, yeah, definitely a fresh, fresh peach. All right, next one we got going on here is Kiwi Berry Dreamin'. So, Kiwi Berry Dreamin' is a Finest vanilla bean ice cream mixed with light notes of kiwi, kiwi and berries. It will have you dreaming of a California escape all day. So, have it sitting here on my Dual SX by Signature Mods at, with my Dot Mod version 2 at 0 0.36 ohms, 5.09 volts at 72 watts. Go ahead and make sure she's juiced up good. This one to me is a little strange, just a little bit. Now, I get the kiwi. I definitely get the kiwi. I get a little bit, a little bit of like a medley, like a berry medley flavor in it. Kiwi, you definitely get like full of, like punch in your face kiwi, like right on the inhale. As you exhale, you get a little bit of the berries. A little bit of uh, vanilla bean ice cream. Um, to me, it's a little strange. I, I don't know if it's just my taste buds or if it's my taste palettes or what's wrong with them. But to me, it's kind of just a little strange. Just I, I like kiwis, but, you know, I just I don't know how I feel about this juice in particular. I mean, it's different. It's definitely a fruity flavor. If you're into fruity flavors, I definitely recommend this one. Um... So, let me see here. It's weird. It's got like a kiwi... Kiwi inhale, berry... Berry medley. You do get the... Like the smoothness of the cream on the exhale. Just a smoothness of the vanilla bean ice cream. It's just... It's kind of a little awkward taste for me. I mean, that's probably just me. But, of course, this is all subjective, guys. Everybody's taste buds are different. So, that's that one. Now, let's go on to my favorite one here. Okay, I have my Hexome. I love my Hexome. Uh, sitting on top is the Tsunami RDA. And we're going to be reviewing the West Coast Frappe. Now... This one is a French vanilla style cappuccino with just the right touch of hazelnut and caramel cream. Local coffee shops got nothing on this one. Okay, so. As you've seen in my last juice review, I think I'm going through like a coffee stage. Like, it's really bad. Like, I think like I'm craving coffee like all the time. So it's like constantly on my mind. Like, I want coffee. So, you know, I catch myself stopping at Starbucks all the time. All that good stuff. So... This one is the favorite one of this line, and it is just, it is a really good, really good coffee vape. Uh, of course, it's not going to taste like a traditional coffee. Uh, let me go ahead and take a toot, guys. It's definitely good. You get the vanilla, vanilla frappuccino flavor. It's that... Price one of the more spot on frappuccino flavors I've had. Um, it's definitely it's not overwhelming in no way. The vanilla is good. You get a 
you get a little bit more throat hit with this one than you do with all the rest of them. But it's a good throat hit. It's kind of like uh, it's kind of like a bunch of little Martians dancing on your tongue. So. It's not a harsh, harsh throat hit, but it is a little bit more there than all the other flavors. All the other flavors are a little bit more smoother. This one has just a little bit more throat hit. Does the, you do take the taste of vanilla cappuccino. It does not taste like coffee at all. It doesn't taste like coffee. It tastes like a frappuccino. So it's a lot more muted than a coffee. So it's a little bit more lighter for you. So I mean, out of all the out of all the line and juices that I've reviewed on this line here, the West Coast Frappe gets my win here. So. Without further ado, guys, I know why you were watching this video. Also, I want to say thank you so much, Wolfpack Wholesale, for sending this my way to review. Um, I will leave a link in the description, as I always do, to where you can get some of this, where I got it, all that good stuff. Now, on to the giveaway, guys. So... As promised, I am going to announce the giveaway winners. Now, keep in mind, guys, if you did not win this, that does not mean it's the end of the world. It means that I will be doing more giveaways, and I will be, hopefully, if you guys decide to stay, the ones that have joined me on this quest of YouTubing, hopefully you guys will stick around, and we will be able to do more giveaways, and hopefully that will better your chances of winning. Now, I did do this by random.org, so kind of took a little learning curve. I actually had to watch a YouTube video to figure out how to do it. But anyways, guys, I did do it, and I have the three winners of the three tsunamis. So, below, I will be announcing the giveaways for the three brand new tsunamis. Perfectly packaged, just wonderful. Now, the winner, the first winner is terminator so second winner is steven gibson now i'm not that good with names so if i mess your name up i'm sorry now the third winner is jesse figgins now what you guys got to do is you have to email me your shipping information at subomsaint at gmail.com i will be shipping it out maybe friday well, not maybe, but I'll definitely be shipping it out this Friday for you guys. So you probably will receive it Monday, Tuesday. So, sorry. Uh, I do work during the week, so it does kind of make it a little bit harder for me to make it to the post office because I do work night shift. So, anyways, yeah. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. And as always, guys... Don't 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 be bummed out if you didn't win. I promise there will be more giveaways in the future. Uh, this time I just wanted to kind of buy three items to kind of better everybody's chances. And plus I wanted to give back. I mean, that's, that's the biggest thing to me is giving back and showing my appreciation to you guys. And my screen went out. So, yeah. That means the video is kind of getting a little long. But anyways, guys. I will be doing more rev more reviews, more giveaways, all that good stuff. So just please stay tuned and... If you don't want to stay, then you don't want to stay. I'm not going to wring your arm to stay. So, I will see you guys next time as I end this on a West Coast frappe. Alright, guys. So, congratulations to the winners. And thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll be back with the more Nitty and the Gritty.